WordPress is a great platform to create versatile forms such as surveys, polls, quiz, subscription, feedback, and more. You can easily create different types of forms in WordPress. There are many popular form plugins in WordPress that comes with a visual form builder interface. So you can quickly create forms and collect submissions from your site visitors. Many WordPress users also have a Notion workspace and would love to connect WordPress and Notion, to push WordPress form entries to a Notion database. If you would like to connect your WordPress forms and Notion database, you should use the Tablesome free plugin that is available in the WordPress repository. Link to this plugin is given in the description. Tablesome allows you to connect some of the popular WordPress form plugins to your Notion database using Notion API. You could integrate form plugins such as WP Forms, Elementor Forms, and Contact Form 7 to Notion. Additional form plugin integrations are in the pipeline. If you would like to integrate a specific form plugin, please post your feature request in the link below. Let's see how to integrate WordPress Forms and Notion. First you need to create a new integration in Notion. To do this go to your Notion workspace and click Settings and Members which will open a pop-up page. In the Workspace Settings pop-up page, click Integration. and then click develop your own integration. It will take you to the My Integrations page. Here click the plus new integration button. Give this integration a name, select the workspace you want to integrate, and then select the capabilities for this integration. Forms integration requires all of the three content capabilities, read, update, and insert content. Then click submit and the new Notion integration will be created. On the integration page, copy the internal integration token to paste it into your WordPress site. Just because you have created an integration token, API key, doesn't mean that the integration has access to the Notion pages. You have to give access to a specific Notion page, where you have the database. To do this, go to the Notion page with the database and click Share which will be found in the top right corner of the Notion page. Then click the Invite button. Select the Notion integration that you just created and again click Invite. Now the specific Notion page with the database will be accessible using the Notion API. Now you have to add the internal integration token to the WordPress site. To do this you need to install the Tablesome plugin. To install Tablesome go to your WordPress dashboard. and then click Plugins, and click Add New. Search the keyword Tablesome. And then install and activate the Tablesome plugin. Now go to Tablesome, click Tablesome Settings. And then click Integrations and choose Notion Integration. Here paste the internal integration token in the Notion API key field, and click the Connect to Notion button. After Notion is connected, click Save to save the Tablesome settings. Now your WordPress site is connected to the Notion API. Now you have to create a workflow for form to Notion and Tablesome by setting up triggers and actions. Before you move to the steps below, you have to create a form with a WordPress form plugin with plugins that are supported by Tablesome. Let's create a new table for the workflow. Give the table a suitable title and move to the Triggers and Actions toolbar to create a trigger. Under the Trigger 1 section select the form plugin that you have used in the Integrations field. Next, add the Unform Submit in the Types of Actions field and then select the form that you want to export to Notion. Now a new section named Action, Set 1, will be opened. And you have to add the Notion integration here. And choose Add Record to Notion DB in the Actions field. 
Select the Notion database where you want to save the form data. Next, you have to map the form fields to the Notion table fields. Before you do this, save the table. Field mapping tells tables on which of your form fields relate to the corresponding fields in the Notion table. For example, you would want to map the WordPress form name field to the name field in Notion. Currently, Tablesum comes with only manual field mapping and automatic field mapping is in the pipeline. You have to create Notion columns corresponding to the WordPress form fields, and the Notion columns should have properties that match with the form field data. Now, I've created all the necessary Notion columns with matching properties. Let's go to Tablesum and match the necessary field that you want to export to the Notion database. First, select the form field on the left side and then select the corresponding Notion column on the right side. Repeat this process for each field on your WordPress form. Click the Save Table button at the bottom to save your changes. Now that you have mapped all the fields, you can send test data from your WordPress form and see if the data is sent to the Notion database. Click the Submit button and check the Notion database. You can see that the WordPress form entry is automatically exported to the Notion database. Tablesum also comes with many other WordPress form automation features such as saving form submissions to tables in WordPress, automatically export contact to MailChimp, display tables on WordPress front-end pages, and many more. Take some time to check out these features. Like and share these videos. Subscribe to this channel to get more useful content like this. And post your question in the comments.